guys, it's Queen DJ, and in today's video, I will be reacting during to the finale. Guys, we really are. The finale of Sounds of Life. I'm really, I'm sad. I am. I, I, like, I hate the fact that I'm, like, sad because at the same time, I'm happy because this was such a good show, but I'm sad because of the fact that it's ending. Come here, Cody. Um, and I don't want it to end. It's just, it was a damn good show. And then the fact that these, this is going to be, I the way I just said that, this is going to be the last two episodes. It, it's just, I don't want to watch them. That's the thing. I just want to avoid them and skip them and then just be like, yeah, we're both running it next week. But no, we're actually, come here. Um, we're actually going to be done with this. And it's just sad to really realize it. And it came too quickly in my opinion. I'm just saying that, but other than that, let's go ahead and get started with episode 25 and 3, 2, 1, go. Oh my god. That is a lot of my ear. Like, holy crap. Come here. Come here. You just want to go on my bed. Because they always say, don't be sad that it's over. Be happy that you were a part of this journey with these characters and everything. And that's how I feel. I feel about that like almost any anime I watch. It's just going to be so weird next week when I start a new series and I'm just like, damn, I don't want to start it. <laughs> They're like, can we just go back? And <laughs> just like, sounds like it's going to get another season. That's all. That's all I want to hear. I mean, it would be nice, but I don't know how far it is and if it has a manga or this was an original story, but... We'll never know, but still, it's sad. I just don't want it to end, and it's gonna end in less than one freaking episode, and I'm just probably gonna cry. I shouldn't have watched this first. I should have watched Simple Gear first, because if I watched Simple Gear, I would have been fine. I wouldn't have cried. Nothing. But you're gonna see me cry. I wasn't ready to cry today. first. Yeah, but you gotta go all out. You just don't know what can happen. What?
I can't pet you the whole time, baby. Jesus Christ. Are you okay? Go play. Go lay down.
my god, I keep on crying. I have no words. I'm like speechless right now.
Thanks for making me cry. <laughs> okay. No, this guy died. It was beautiful. Oh my god. Oh. Uh. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> I guess they think they did that. It was beautiful. He did fine. No, no! <laughs> you still did good. Okay. <laughs> The woman, she's emotional. Go to the bathroom and get some. That everyone's just going. Uh huh. It's a group effort. <laughs> now it's really a group effort. Gotta be close She's there. We're gonna find her. She's got to be around here somewhere.
go out and leave. Oh my god, that's so mean. That's so mean. That's mean. That's really, really mean. I'm just gonna say that now. I mean, oof, but that performance. Ah. Uh, I'm still crying. <laughs> but you know when a performance moves you like that much and you get really emotional? Like, I remember, like, as someone who was in chorus and the performance that moved me and you cried and you didn't know you cried until you like you checked your face and you're wondering like why you're crying it's just that good of the performance and stuff it's the same thing whether it's an instrumental or anything like oh, that performance was just beautiful i mean i got goosebumps That hurt, oh my god, like, you could just feel every emotion that everybody felt. I mean, like, it was a little weird that after they were done, no one clapped, and then once they were getting ready to leave, we started to slow clap. I mean, if I could, I would have did a standing ovation myself, but, like, oh. I just want the best for them. This is the last episode that's coming up. Jose King's finally gonna be able to get clarity with her mom, and I'm so happy for her and proud of her. I'm glad her mom was able to come. Thank you, Akira, because if Akira didn't bring her mom, her and her mom would have had that, like, I feel some type of way, and her brother, just too much. It's just going to be happy moments for, like, the rest of this next episode. Maybe even some more crying moments. I don't know. I mean, like, what I'm kind of hoping is, I, I still, okay, I'm going to say this. I don't think Kanata and, you know, they're going to confess. I don't think it. They may... But I'm kind of really hoping for Hosekin and Ch uh, Chica to just confess first, and then they can get to the end of the show, and then the other two can confess if they want to. Heck, this show could possibly end with nobody confessing to each other. Who knows? But as someone who likes these ships of this dang show, I mean, I would like to see somebody confess to someone else before this dang show ends. We only got one episode left, and anything can happen in the last freaking episode. But, I mean, ooh. I just, it just, even during it, I felt speechless. All I could do was freaking cry because that's all I felt was like tears because it was just so moving and beautiful. And, ah, uh, it just, it's Suzu with the Sozo, but that, that's okay. That's Suzu. Mm, but that was, oh, I'm just scared about what the results are going to be. Who's going to be able to go to nationals? I want them to go, but honestly, who really knows? Y'all know. I said this a thousand times, y'all know, I don't know, I'm about to know in a couple of minutes, but, whew, it was so beautiful, but go ahead and pause the video, and I'll see you guys in one second for the final episode. Okay, final episode in three, two, one, go. My thing is, are they going to play opening? I mean, typically for shows, when it's the last episode, it's a yes and a no, it could be a no, no, I mean, we could just go ahead and Give the opening. Because there is a butt in there.
and we can we show in the opening anyway. But that see, that's a good way to start the episode. Oh my god! Like, oh, ho, 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 ho. finally, finally, after <laughs> episode like, for mommy. Oh. We can end the episode now. I don't even need to watch the rest. I, that was a good final thoughts on it. This is a damn good show. Ten out of ten would recommend. I mean, honestly, like it was beautiful. I'm happy. Thank you for watching. I'm just kidding though. But ah, uh, that was so good. I'm not gonna cry again. Mm -hmm. I already cried too much. I did it, guys. Love me. <laughs> Finally, mommy acknowledged her kid. Like, oh. That's not what any child wants for their parents. Oh my god. <laughs> it's too late. <laughs> Come here. Hello, how are you doing? Oh, don't be sorry about taking her home for us. You did the right thing. You got that guy stopping? Him, what are you doing? Not stupid. Oh!
You're the only one can go. In a way, y'all almost couldn't basically come with that agreement. Of course, they're not even going to say the name of this girl. <laughs> you won't say it. I think this. <laughs> Please. Oh my God. I'm so scared right now. Yeah. <sighs> 
I can relax now. It's like, ooh. Seriously? Being right now. That's all that matters.
it. And I write all the time of crying. Oh. You still think I died. It's already proud of me. Cool. Okay. Final thoughts on this one. I enjoyed this show a lot. I mean, as a show that came out last year, as we said, and I really wanted to watch it, but I didn't really have the time because I was super busy with so many other shows, I'm glad that this was requested because I was originally, I was going to watch this on my own. Like, me, I was going to wait a couple of months after the full show was done, but once I got that feature and I requested about it, I was like, okay, never mind, I have to watch it now. <laughs> Because and it's so funny because typically, which shows that I end up at, like I really want to watch, I either end up watching them on my own, or I end up doing a reaction on them. I mean, this is now officially the second show because the first was Monthly Girls and Saki Dune, and I'm technically done with the show, but I'm not at the same time because I got OVAs. But I kind of wish we had more to this. I mean, it ends in a good way. Everybody's happy. We got the happy ending. They're going to nationals. Everything that I wanted for these characters ever since episode one. It would have been nice if it got an OVA, a movie, something. Because it still, even though it's like over, it still feels like the closure of it isn't necessarily over. And there's still more to the story, possibly. I'm not sure. <laughs>
was sweet. But still, like I said, a movie or a movie, of, like, literally after this would be nice. I mean, this show just ended, like, last year, I'm guessing. So, I mean, if the Twitter page of this or, like, something would have announced maybe either between this year or the next few years that it could possibly get a special or a, um, or a movie or something, it would be nice. Because, as I said, it just... The, it feels really close in a nice, neat little bow, but it still feels like there's a lot of unanswered questions. I would have liked it more if um, Akira and her brother would have had a little bit more in this last episode, except that little moment between them, and then that's it. I love the Hozuki and her mom like moment because that was the best thing. That was the one thing that like we all wanted to see ever since we learned more about Hozuki's past in this situation with her mother. So I'm glad that they were able to save that for the final episode, because it needed to be in the final episode. I mean, if you ended this series with that not happening, I, I would have been pissed. I'm not as pissed about what the fact is that nobody confessed to each other. I'm okay. It. I do love the fact that it did have romance aspect in it, but I'm I'm fine with it not with any of the characters confessing to each to each other. Maybe in the manga they did. Who knows? I don't know. I mean, I would like to read the manga, but like as someone who is currently reading, like I don't know how many mangas I'm reading. I'm reading a little bit too much and. I don't know if I'll be able to add one more. That's the same thing on my gotcha games and ish. And I'm like, yeah, I can go ahead and add one more. And then I'm like, yep, this is hell on earth for me. Like, why did I decide to add another show or gotcha or anything? Because <laughs> then I have to keep up and then I got to make sure I save or whatever. But this was a really, really good series. And I enjoyed it for what it was. I learned new things that honestly, I didn't think I was going to know about the Kyoto intimate instrument because I only knew this much and I felt like I, I I'm not like one of those who's like oh yeah I'm a vast knowledge about this instrument or whatever like ask me freaking anything but really honest good things that I really think I would have never known about almost instrument like a lot of instruments but just instruments in general I mean I know some things but not as much but it was still a damn good series and I would like to see it get something else but I mean, as of right now, in 2020, who freaking knows? Because, honestly, we don't know. With the situation that's going on in the world today, we don't even know what the heck is going to be, you know, coming for spring. I'm not spring. Summer, fall, or anything in the next couple of, not even the next couple of years, in the next couple of months, going into the next year for 2021. But, I mean, if it gets something, then yeah. I'll be there the day it comes out. I'm young. All sub dish and whatever, but honestly, I will miss these characters a lot. I mean, it's gonna be a little weird going into next week and starting my next Patreon show and looking at this new show and be like, damn, I really miss Sounds of Life. I mean, ugh, y'all made me fall in love with another damn teacher, and I mean, Suzu, oh my god. Hi, bye, teacher. <laughs> but I, I enjoyed it a lot. It made me really, really, I mean, this made me so as much as emotional as, like, Sound Emporium did, and then any almost Studio Ghibli that I've seen, like, over and over again, but still, it was really good, and just thank you for joining me on this, like, what, 26, uh, not even 26, what, third, how many other weeks of this show was? I mean, it feels like it's been a month, but it, it was, like, maybe two or three months, maybe. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction to you towards the series Sounds of Life. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially all next Friday for Patreons and next Tuesday for Rails. For the start of my next Patreon series, I'm going to keep that on the hush hush. The Patreons actually know what the next week series I'm going to do. But for the rest of y'all, when we get to next week, or really not even what next week, the following Tuesday... That is, yeah, that is next week. I'm stupid. That following Tuesday, that is when you'll officially see a new show come out. But until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye.